Assalamu alaikum. This is Masood Chaudhary. I'm the president of Bangladesh Chamber of Commerce USA, based in Dallas, Texas. I've been involved with Chamber of Commerce since 2004. We have formed that Chamber of Commerce uh, to help our uh, local Bangladeshi uh, residing in Dallas, Texas areas. And we can take a We have grown. I'm a member on a very good And we are uh, we have done a lot of events. Uh, with government agencies and other business agencies to help promote their, their local businesses. So Amra, a, I'm a very excited to say that Amra Global Business Summit jeta Dubai te hote jache, September mashe. So we are planning on taking a, a delegation from our Chamber of Commerce in da from Dallas, Texas to represent our business community here. So I would encourage everybody to really go participate because that uh, summit looks like or sounds like is going to be a big networking forum internationally to meet all the Bangladeshi people, Bangladeshi business entrepreneurs from all over the world would be there, what I see from the programs and also we'll be able to network with a lot of uh, you know top-notch business operators and government agencies also coming from Bangladesh over there. So I absolutely uh, thrilled to join. So as the president of Bangladesh Chamber of Commerce USA here in Dallas, Texas, I'm encouraging all our members and especially the board of directors. We have 14 board of directors currently and I'm encouraging all of them to really participate in the Global Business Summit that's going to be in Dubai, September 29th and 30th. And uh, we are hoping to take a delegation. And I don't know the exact number, how many people will participate, but we are really hoping and we are waiting for the date to get a little bit closer, especially during this pandemic. Things are very uncertain. Uh, I knew it, it was canceled or postponed at one time already. So all the details is online and you know everybody interested. We are as Bangladesh Chamber of Commerce. We can provide information to my community people, to other business people here. Uh, myself, I'm a business owner here in Dallas, Texas. Uh, multiple businesses involved in different different kind of businesses and I'm also looking forward to go to the summit and network with other Bangladeshi business people, business owners, entrepreneurs coming, joining the summit internationally from all over the world and uh, from Bangladesh. I have several different uh, businesses but I am also, I'm, primarily I am a fast food restaurant Sonic Drive-In, many of you may not be familiar with, is, uh, is uh, America's, uh, uh, you know, they call the America's most loved restaurant brand. You know, it's a drive-in concept, so I'm a franchisee of that brand in multiple locations across the Dallas Metroplex. Uh, I also have involved in some real estate, uh, commercial and residential real estates, and I also involved in the retail sections of a uh, convenience store. Uh, business also that uh, we have partners with and they take care of those those part of the businesses uh, and one thing I must say that now I'm looking into that when we look at the uh, the prospects of Bangladesh and uh, how the business in Bangladesh is growing in, in all different areas what really excites me when I look into the uh, startup businesses the startup businesses is just I, I mean amazing and recently, government has formed the Start Business uh, Startup Business Limited. You know, I was really excited to hear a little bit more, a little more about that. Uh, with government backups, they're backing up all the people that who wants to start a business, and also, uh, you know, see what are the opportunities. Just going to this summit in Dubai, I think we'll learn, and I'm I'm pretty open to learn. So, what are the opportunities to do business in Bangladesh? Uh, and at this age, after doing business all these years here, you know, my focus, my intention is to really do some business in Bangladesh. So I'm looking forward in learning and to look and see what are the opportunities, whether it's going to be a startup business or, you know, or, or and what are, what's out there. Banking, I want to learn a little bit more about the NRB part of the banking prospects in Bangladesh, you know, and I'm, and I'm, and I, I see, you know, all the news and everything else, and, and I, I, I know, you know, how much opportunities there is. So it's very exciting time for all the non-resident Bangladeshis living all across the world to really join and see what's out there. I think we can really contribute a lot to our country if we put our heads together and go and, and spend some time 
and some finance and, and do some business in Bangladesh. And I think it's going to be a mutual win-win situation. So Bangladesh Chamber of Commerce USA, even though it sounds like a national organization, National Chamber of Commerce, but it's actually limited to a local Bangladeshi business owner operators here in Dallas, Fort Worth, Metroplex. It's a pretty large community here and, and Bangladesh Chamber of Commerce it was formed in 2004 and it was a small business community back then but now it's just you know growing I mean every year we have more business people more entrepreneurs are getting involved they want to learn more about the businesses so as Bangladesh Chamber of Commerce it is our primary responsibility to really you know team them up help them you know, whether they need to go, you know, where they can go get funding, uh, you know, whether it's going to be government, you know, SBA funding or local conventional fundings. That's the prim one thing. Again, how to acquire, you know, we you know, provide some information about how to, you know, negotiate a lease or, you know, how they can go about and purchasing, you know, if they're going to buy a property, uh, business properties and stuff like that. Those are small things. And then we also did business uh, expo where we brought in different vendors, including government vendors like SBAs. We had a bunch of banks that people can actually walk through and it's like an exhibition, like a trade show. So we have done some of that. And then due to the pandemics for the last couple of years, I would say that we have really slowed down in doing anything we needed to do. So uh, we are looking forward for this business summit again, I must say that that's going to take place uh, in September 29 and 30th in Dubai that that we can go and you know learn a lo lot and get to know a lot of different businesses and what other people are doing around the world as Bangladeshi but personally I mean I have several several friends that have said that they will be going from different part of the world and I'm just really excited to go see them and meet them and uh, you know and have a great time two days you know is going to be learn and socialize and after that uh, attend the Dubai Expo, which is scheduled to be from October 1st. So I must thank the organizers, you know, of that expo. I know there's a lot of hard work goes behind it. So thank you very much from the bottom of our heart to put up that, that kind of uh, event. Uh, and also I'd like to thank uh, Business uh, America for, you know, taking time and, and uh, talking to us and publishing a lot of, time, a lot of, lot of different publications from time to time. It's very informational and uh, a lot to learn from there. Also thank uh, Global Business Television, GBTV, for all the programs. I pretty much try to uh, keep up with it in YouTube and all the, all the shows. And you have excellent, you know, photographers who take good, great pictures. And so thank you for everybody, for everything that you guys have done and doing for the business community and for the Bangladeshi community uh, worldwide. So thank you.